Yes, sir. You already know it's your boy behaves. We back with another one. Let's go ahead and get right into it. You know, we don't like to waste nobody's time. Before we do that, let's get this video a thumbs up so I can reach more people. Today, we'll be touching bases on Zomerica. That's ticker symbol ZOM. I just want to give y'all a quick update, some reassurance, let y'all know we still bullish on Zomerica. It's going to be a pullback. Of course, I was expecting a market correction because we've been bullish for the past few days. We've been at the March 5th of that correction. We've been night on a straight bull run and bullish momentum so it's only right that we have a little pullback correction just to have a healthy market we don't want to go straight up anyway because when we go straight up it could be a, a big nice panic fall so i'd rather gradually go up have pullbacks along the way and steady rise if that makes sense to y'all so i want y'all to be pouncing on zomedica you should be adding to the deal i always told y'all you want to save your firepower your firepower is your funds is your is your money that you use to buy more shares with so with that being said let's talk about the chart let's talk about the graph let's talk about where this is headed where we got support and resistance at so we opened at 261 the high was 274 the low was 227 the 52 week high was 291 the 52 week low was 0 0.06 cent and i know a lot of people probably got caught up in FOMO this morning because though medical opened up at 265 and then ran up to 272 as soon as it did that it panicked all the way down to two dollars and twenty seven cents making you if you bought at the top just today when we been put everybody on this play if you just now buying today at the top you done lost uh, a nice size of your portfolio just that quick but if you did get caught and did get stuck, the medical real will recover. It will come back. It real re retest that 272 and work its way to three dollars plus. And I told y'all that's why our exit point was three dollars. That's what we're gonna get out of this one. At. Yes, it can go to four and five dollars and probably much higher than that. But I mean, hey, we all executives at the end of the day. You executive, I'm an executive. I like to get mine. I don't like to be greedy in this market. The market don't humble me. I learned lessons, plenty of lessons, and I try to share them with y'all so y'all won't make the same mistakes. But we getting out of this. Anybody want to rock with me, you rock. Even whether you rock with me or not, just because I get out at three, that don't mean y'all have to go out at three. I just try to give y'all safe entry and exit points to where I know y'all good. You feel me? So let's go ahead and check out the 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 resistance and the support. Right now, we got a support on Zomedica at 241. If this thing get back up above $2.41, we're going to fly straight to green. We're going to become green on the day and go retest that $2.72. And tomorrow, if we if we go green on the day, we probably could open up much higher than that $2.72. Probably open up at that $3, at $3 plus, especially if we can get that momentum back into the green. So where I support at, resistance $2.41, our support is around $2.26. Right there at 227 that we pulled back to, if we look back on the one week chart on March 12th, we hit that same 226 before rising up. And we got a nice support around that 226 level. If we break that support at 226, we, we break that support at 226, we, we could possibly see the low twos around 208, 205. And, and then from there, that'd be another loading zone. But I would suggest. I would suggest selling, if it break 225, I would suggest selling half your position and buying back the other half at the low, at the low twos, especially if if your average ain't one in the ones and the 177, 180, or we put us in on this play at. So just some advice. So that's all I got for y'all this video. I just want to give y'all a quick update, reassurance on it, let y'all know we still, you know, we still bullish on Zomedical, especially this just a little pullback, a healthy pullback. And I hope y'all pounce and add it to this deal. And if it dip further around the low twos, be ready to add some more. So that's all I got for y'all. If y'all like these type of updates, these type of predictions, all that good stuff, consider joining the family. It's much love, y'all. God bless y'all. We out.